Misty? Ow! More likely a neuron was fired for Victor to check out. Or Ow! Maybe ask him both. Hey, Internet! It's Jessica, and welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. Uh, we got terrible news in the last episode. We lost our best friend. We're basically dying. And Johnny Silverhand's consciousness is in our brain. And, um, I don't really know how to, like, think about, like, what I want V to do. Because, uh, Misty gave us the option to either, like, block Johnny Silverhand out or let him take over my body. I'm not entirely sure what I want to do because I don't even know what Johnny's role yet. Aside from being Keanu Reeves. But I don't know what to do with about this. Anyway, wow, I can turn my neck all the way over like this, huh? Okay. Um, I should get some sleep. I doubt we'll get any. Once again, V doesn't know how to use a pillow or a bed. Gotta get out of here, understand? Um... And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way. You included. Damn! Alright, Johnny Jesus! You know, I didn't think he was gonna be mean, like... I didn't think his character was gonna be like this. Like, so angry. Where'd you stash yours? He's trying to get a hold of our body right now. Listen, Johnny, you're not in control at the moment. You may be hot because you're Keanu Reeves, but this ain't happening. First of all, I don't smoke. Don't smoke. Then go out and get some. Just need one last one. No! Jesus Christ, man! The f kind of joint toy are you supposed to be? Whoa! Ghost off! I would punch you right now, and I would kiss you at the same time. Anyway, <laughs> um, can I like say anything else to him? No. Whoa! Ah! Jesus! Wait, he can hurt me. Start talking. Wait, he can touch me. Myself. No, wait. Ah. What happened? Victor said don't touch the chip because it will kill us. I'll take control. No! This ain't your body, you dumb- I'll find a way. Oh my god. You hear me? Okay, this is gonna be a problem. I really didn't think it was gonna go down like this. Where am I now? Take meth? Oh. I guess See I have no choice. Never, asshole. Now like that! Stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger! Wow, he can really just do that! Ow! I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. I'm that like sounds sexual. Fruit creeping, creeping into you. you. Nothing, Nothing I can, I can do, do about it. it. You hear me? I'd puke if I could. It's just a copy of the. I guess he's just mad because he's been stuck in here for like how many years, right? Get out of my head! Leave me alone! Get out! Just get the get out! out. Let to the head only think that we fix this. Hear me, bitch! A bullet to the brain! <sighs> me. Oh my god! He's gonna be a problem! But then again, you know what the thing is? I don't want to keep using the Omega blockers either because I feel like the more I take the pill, the more he's gonna be a nuisance to V. 
That's the way I see it. Have I just been laying in the shower? We're on act two now. Oh my goodness. This is a horrible day. Horrible! I don't even know how long we've been- Dear Miss V, I would like to inform you that Mr. Wells' body has been delivered to Victor Valcor's clinic in accordance with your instructions. Okay, at least Victor has Jackie. I should probably talk to him later, right? Stock up on ammo, open your inventory, put some clothes on, and check your email. Damn, I got a lot of stuff to do. Okay, first of all, let me put some clothes on and also level myself up. Uh, what is this? That's for Johnny, isn't it? I think this is saved for him. I'm gonna do aerial damage. Screw that. I wanna get that. I'll increase the breach time for the protocol. I'll do that. One message. Rent past due? Dear sir or madam, our records show we have not received this month's rent payment for your unit. In accordance with the tenancy agreement, any subsequent payment delay will re result in forced eviction from property. Oh my god. Oh! Takimura! Takimura here. We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. I think I can trust this man. I have a feeling what happened in the last episode, he wasn't betraying the reason that guy called him called me a traitor, it wasn't directed at me. I think it was at him. Hmm. Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already tolled. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Okay. Also, I just found out the voice actor for Takimura is Gaku Space, which uh, you guys probably know him as Genji from like Overwatch. Was that whole thing Johnny Silverhand? Your vehicle is available for collection nearby parking garage. We wish you a pleasant day. Okay. See this stuff! What is this? The countdown. Bad news from Vic. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda worried that like, when does Johnny like show up? Like he's gonna appear out of nowhere, you know what I mean? I don't want a jump scare from him. <laughs> oh! What the hell?! Johnny, did you see what happened? Something feels off here. You don't say. I don't mean the wreck, I mean the run. City's most courteous chauffeur up and drives away from the scene of an accident. What the fuck? Why did he just hit me like that? Okay, so- Oh my god, my car! Are you fucking serious? Please accept our sincerest apologies. Excess damages and compensation. Okay, a fixer just sent you an offer to buy a vehicle. Whenever you receive an offer from a new marker or appear on the minimap, to buy a vehicle, go to indicate a location and confirm your purchase. Okay, and a piece of my car is floating. That's fucking great. That makes me sad. That was like the last thing that I had of Jackie. He's the one who bought us that car. That makes me upset. V, we need to talk. Please pick up. I found something that belongs to Jackie. I think he would have wanted to have it. It's waiting in front of your apartment. Oh my god, the mom. What is this? Key to Jackie's bike? Oh, I got Jackie's bike. D? Been a long time since you called. Since Jackie passed away. Wanted to call you before Mama Wells, but... You know how it is. You had other important things on your mind. Mm. It's not Maybe really that. that. What's the matter? Just want to know how you're holding up. Just wanted to know how... You know, you were holding up. No good, B. Parents should not bury their own children. Mm. I can't even do this. Mira, don't worry. I take care of myself. I worry! She's I like our mom too, right? What you did before. Just promise me you won't get yourself killed, okay? May he watch over you, Mia. 
Oh. I have a question. Can I call Jackie on here? Like, what would happen if I call him? This number is temporarily unavailable. Please leave a message. I'll ask one last time. Oh, so I, I know clue to. where you are. What happened to you? Oh, God, so fucked up. Hey, just orbital air. You're there somewhere. Fuck. Oh! What am I doing? Oh, that makes me so sad. God damn it, Jackie. It makes me upset because, like, he really thought this was gonna be the one big job where he can finally be like, I don't have to worry about anything. I can make money and then leave this life behind. And, you know, the ironic part- I'm gonna take Jackie's bike. The ironic part is he did leave this life behind. It's just not in the way that he thought he would. That's so upsetting. Oh, there's his bike! God damn it, Jackie. Alright, let's go to Delamain HQ first, get a new car, because friggin' Delamain just crashed into me, and then we'll meet up with Takimura. So we're- we finally unlocked the other parts of the map, because I couldn't go here before, since everything was in lockdown. Um, but now we get to go to the nice area of Night City. Which I can tell because all the roads are very clean and new, you know? Alright, let's see what's going on in here. My lawyer's gonna go data crash on your ass! You hear me? He'll run you out of biz! Would Hello? you be so kind as to give me your lawyer's contact information? Fuck you, Cirque Brain! Thank Damn. You. Processing data now. Please wait. Hey, Delamain! You crashed hey, into Del my car! Hello, sir or madam. How can I be of service? Hey, hey. you was last in line. Look, okay, I had a bad day. Well, well I'm in the front now. Well, now I'm in the front. <laughs> Got a problem? No, no, it's fine. Uh huh. Hello, sir, I'm into you, Del. Don't recognize me? You sent me a message saying I should come in about the accident. You are currently speaking to a Delamay network subroutine. Alas, my operational capabilities are limited. God damn it, James McAvoy! I just need a new car! Recite your incident report I number. any numbers. That's how they find okay. you. Oh. Um... Corps. I'm a corp already, um, whatever. 77 double 11 I don't care zero anymore. One zero incident report on file. Confirmed. 96 at the end. Public enemy. Government target. Wait, your identity what? has been established. Who said that? This is Elaine Pagels. What phrase would best describe your experience of Mrs. Elaine seven, Pagels? Seven, seven, one, one, That's one, not my name! One, zero, one, zero, nine, Cream, six. I basically shit green apples. Nothing serious, no big deal. My ride took a real- I'm gonna talk about my Actually, car! Actually, a little heartbroken about my damaged ride, but I'd rather talk to the real Delamain if I can. V, my apologies if the receptionist was a bother. I'm preoccupied with the crisis that is ongoing, and I simply cannot oversee everything. I okay, that's great, the but... transferring a settlement to your account to compensate for the damage done. Bah. Special treatment. <laughs> would you mind if we spoke elsewhere? Yeah, I would mind. Sure, let's talk. Then please follow the drone. Okay, I don't want to talk in front of these people. They're all like judging me. I like how it has like a happy I'm face. I'm fully aware customer service is less than satisfactory at the moment. Perhaps a guided tour will prove some form of compensation. I don't need this a guided tour. The shop to the office. D Delamain, no, 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 it's okay. I don't need a, like a whole ass tour. It's fine, man. But I just need a new car. Okay. <laughs> is fully automated. That's cool, man. I'm pondering broadening my portfolio to include repair services. Oh, he seems really excited about Alas, this. Um, the shop is currently overwhelmed with work. That's nice. I mean, that's good I for you guys, why. right? I'm still looking into the cause of the Delamay network vehicle failures. My working hypothesis is an advanced virus. Advanced virus? The situation quickly. This sudden rise in incidents is proving costly, aside from drawing unwanted attention to the company. Well, that maybe that explains why I got like freaking hit earlier today. That's the weird. control room. 
I feel honored to have you here. Oh, thanks, Dolomain. Surprisingly. Oh, he has emotions. You don't need no control room. Control rooms are for Ganics. What good is it to you? There was a time this facility was human operated. I simply inherited their infrastructure. Okay. All these lights, what are they for? That's what I wish to discuss with you. A green light denotes a vehicle with which I am in contact. As you can see, that is no longer the case for some vehicles. Those are the red lights. I see, Repair yeah. drones can't take care of this? This time, I fear, human intervention is required. I'm aware you offer a broad range of services and are unusually... Distinct. Are you hiring Thus, me, like Mr. Delamain? my missing vehicles. Why is discretion a concern? Unnoticed, unbothered, right? In my case, broadly tolerated. Yet a marked increase in inspections suggests the authorities have begun monitoring me. Talking in CPD or Netwatch? The latter. My legal status does not fit neatly within current regulations. If I'm not careful, I could easily be categorized as an illegal immigrant. Oh no. You know what? I'll help Delamain. Okay, sure. I kind of like I'm you. <laughs> I'm pleased to hear it. I shall send you the coordinates of their last known locations. You must simply deactivate each. I'll then reassemble. Am I gonna fight cars? Is that what you're telling garage. me I'm gonna do? See what I can do. Delamain vehicles are exceptionally secure. Be sure to have a scanner with decryption capability on your person. I'm gonna have to talk to Victor too. Um alright. Oh, he left? Oh, okay. I guess I'm leaving too. Delamain, where can I buy a new car? Okay, I think I'm gonna go do those, like, Delamain missions, uh, when I live stream. Okay, I think it's time that we go talk to Takimura because, uh, he has some explaining to do. Move out of the way, damn! I wanna know what he has to say, but I feel like I can trust him. I don't think he's completely, like, a terrible person because I know he wants to know what happened to Arasaka. Uh, because he knows that Yorinubo was lying to him, so I want to know what he has to say about that. Okay, I found Tom's diner. Let's see what Takimoto has to say to us. Ugh. Sit. Okay, damn. <laughs> you do not look so bad. Then, Thanks? in the car, I doubted you would survive. Why'd you help Why'd me? Why'd you help me, anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. Why? It's about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Okay, Vic thanks. likes to talk, I guess. Oh, pizza. Not many could do what <laughs> he did. You should be thankful. I am thankful to Victor. It is true. He's a good guy. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Why Evelyn. do you care? What's she to you? She and Yorino Arasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. Been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. Yeah, we she still promised to, talk to help to me her. get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone. Very so what do you away. think I can get a hold of her? What the hell are you talking about? Why are you looking for her? Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? No idea. Think so, yeah. Don't think so, no. Asking too many questions. Honestly, I don't know. She, she was so cryptic when we talked to no her. Clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic, had a large chunk of classified info, an enigma to be sure, but she showed that slyness you get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out lumped with the outcasts easily, or have you forgotten? <sighs> okay, I got a life to save my own, so, um... I'm gonna go. Sorry, I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose. B, so. wait. 
What? I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice? In Night City? I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have I knew I was gonna like this guy. to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? Yeah, we were the I only witness there. Better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. That's why that guy came after you. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. Okay. You want me to act accuse Yorinubo in front of the Ara Arasaka executives? So what, we stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain I don't know if this is gonna work. Night City is so corrupt. Truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It but who's to say that they will save me, the then right make me disappear afterwards? Side. Politics. What, what the hell are you talking exactly about? Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a Paul. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. What's going on? Interview? For who? Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey! I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cup. Whoa! What did you say? Takimura, you relax! Heard me. Let it go, Takimura. Please, you don't know anyone here. Let's not get, like, beat up. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Shut up, you racist! <laughs> not defending your ass! You okay? We have to be careful. I know, I know this is like, it, it's his people. He's used to being with the Arasaka and the Corpos, but like, bro, you gotta relax. Last thing we want to do is draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. It's okay. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need we have nowhere to go anyway. I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Try my luck with Evelyn. Relic Engineer knows more than anyone else. Oh my god! I don't know who I want to pick. The relic engineer. No time to waste, B. Okay, re relax. Um, the relic engineer may know, but I don't know if he's willing to like help because he escaped for a reason. I feel like I have a chance with Evelyn because I didn't rot her out with Dexter Deshawn. You know what I mean? But I didn't say yes to her either. But I want to try with Evelyn. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. No, I feel like Honor I can get her thieves. to say something. Ever heard of it? Mm -hmm. Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. You're an Obu Arasaka degree? I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. What about the relic engineer Anders guy? Home. 
He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means Someone's picking another fight with Arasaka, <laughs> so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Well, we don't know that. Defected? Where to? Some other corp poach him? As far as I can tell, he acted alone. A meticulous man. He planned it. Covered his tracks very well. Any idea where he took off to? None. Okay. Hmm, somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. It I was actually really, my job. I actually really like Takamoto. Is that just me? I really like him. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. She spot the corpo in you? No experience talking to people like that? Mean to say you worked for Saburo, yet got no idea how to talk to the high and mighty. She wished to have nothing to do with the man accused of murdering Saburo Arasaka. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. I'd be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. <laughs> I cannot stay here any longer. You shouldn't. Do they don't what like you, you want. Here. Look for Parker, Helma, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Okay. Be so careful. Then, if by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. All right. Again, I feel like I can trust him. I'm just saying. Oh shit! Here comes Johnny. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka is still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. Was Rogue that really hot lady in, in, in his past? You know, you've got some nerve. First you're out to kill me, now you want to be my pal and make like nothing happened? You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk. Oh, everyone's staring at me. What do you want? And I've processed <laughs> some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're you. Yeah, so? It doesn't mean you gotta be a dick to me, I dude. I don't want this either. Back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. How can I know I, I can trust you right now? Why you know? should I trust you? Remind me again. Trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. It's the least <laughs> of our worries, anyway. Least of your worries, because if I die, you still get my body. It doesn't matter. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you've had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What would I say to her? I got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Oh, okay. Don't need convincing. <laughs> Seen your memories. Gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. Johnny, I don't, again, I know you said it doesn't matter if I can trust you or not, but like, it does matter because I'm the one so, in control. Ready? There is no us. He's gone. Oh my god. This is gonna be a while before we can like, get used to this. 
Let me call Judy. I, I want to hit her up anyway for like, you know, a date, but I need to talk to her. Maybe she knows where Evelyn is because they're friends. That you? Yeah. I thought you were gone. Uh, You're not same. Oh my god. I thought it was game over for me. Went ass up, huh? Not as planned. Want to talk about Listen, Evelyn? Need to find Evelyn. Actually, let me get off the bike. I really don't want to talk about her. No, I, she I is? need your help. What I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. You're the only Can lead you? I got. Come on. You're my one hope. The only lead I got. Obi Wan Kenobi, you're my only hope. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I want to? Come Can we on. meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? She just hung up on me! Okay, we're gonna meet her at, uh, freaking the bar. Anyway, I'm a little bit concerned about Johnny in my head, but, uh, we've got no choice. We kind of have to deal with him now, right? Hey, haven't I seen you here before? Yeah, I'm a regular here. Anyway, got a good memory for faces. Huh? Here for a good time. What up? Do I look as fine as I feel right now? Come on now. Don't hey, can I talk to the bartender? What's his name again? Do something. Mateo. Mateo. Hey. Um. Looking for Evelyn Parker. Haven't seen her around. And you've got no idea where she is. Not the slightest. No idea where she could be. Bartender, not her secretary. Okay, what about Judy? Want to talk to Judy? Hmm. The question is, does she want to talk to you? She hung up on me. Find out soon enough. Is she in her suite? Probably. But Tara really is like a low-key guy. He doesn't like rat anyone out. Anyway. <laughs> Judy is embarrassing herself again. Wonder what? why Sue even keeps her around. Hey, where are you going? Nothing to see back Let here. Let it lie. Judy's friend. What's going on with Judy? Stop telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? I don't. Must be our rep. Girls need help, they come here. Last time I checked, we weren't running a shelter. Come on, they all deserve a chance. Anyone could end up useful. Give it some time. They'll pay for themselves. Pay? Chicks can barely take care of themselves. Not when their faith down in the mud. Aw, she wants to give people a chance. I hate surprises. Mm-hmm. Really feeling that sense of community right now. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. Uh wanted to ask you something. Not now. Susie Q. Okay. Judy? You just don't give up, do you? No. When it comes to pretty girls, no. To to <laughs> Thought I made that clear. Or was I just too subtle for you? What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Is that your boss or something? Susie seems to know what she wants. Is she your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? Okay, fine. Listen, I'm looking for Evelyn. Have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist? No? Does she didn't know who hired her? She it Sounds to me like you two talk, not your concern. Need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. I won't lay a hand on her. Wouldn't make sense. Fine. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Okay. Mega Tower. <laughs> Luxurious. So, uh, you busy this weekend, you or? You need something? Uh, she went back there? Clouds? What's Clouds? Clouds. 
What's that? It's a dollhouse. Sounds vaguely familiar. Doll that where they tailor code things to your fetishes and whatnot? Client subconscious is the script. Doll is it like a... It. No memory of it after, though, luckily. Thank Christ for that. What does that mean? I don't know what that means, okay? Wait, mean to say she's a doll? Hm. Saved up for that behavior chip a while, too. Ev was good. Real good. Had regulars booked up weeks. Is she like a, like a, like a Nobody escort? Long in a gig like that, I'm very though. confused. <laughs> it's the heist. Figures. Think she might have gone back there? Said it'd be safer than here. God knows why. Got everything I need for now. Thanks. I'll look in on the place. Okay, bye, bye Judy. Um, please don't be mad at me. Wait. Huh? Um, what? Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. Sure. Um. Do you, do you have a thing with Give her? You a or, okay. Or just friends? Thanks. Thank you, V. Yeah, of course. Okay. okay. So if y'all have a thing, I don't want to like get in the middle of that. Just saying. Oh my god. A Johnny, doll. stop! Why am I not surprised? You're an engram and a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the yeah. hell not? Any other running commentary you want to give Johnny? So every time I look away, he disappears. Interesting. He is gonna scare me a lot though, because he'll just appear out of nowhere. Just... Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good what? shit, if I say so myself. Wait, what? Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. Cuts virtues like they were done. Are you calling me out because I have a crush on her? Damn straight. Would what you is look this? at that? You see it too, right? So yeah. I'm completely whacked, or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty. Yeah. Ow! More likely a neuron was <laughs> fired for Victor to check out. Or Ow! Maybe ask them both. <laughs> Ow! Okay, so the, no one else can see this but me and Johnny, huh? That's kind of weird. It's a graffiti. Tarot card the magician. Oh yeah, that is Misty because she does tarot card readings. No, no, no. Oh, talking about a scholar. Can you talk? It is important. What? What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. Uh, okay, how is That's he gonna, gonna help? help us how, exactly? There will be a meeting. You, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at Kompiki Brother. Okay. I have little hope that he will be convinced. But it will be a start. Taka, you're so... Are you sure you can trust this man? You're not in Arasaka anymore. People, they don't like you. You want to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. Sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one man. Yes, I trust him. How can you be... How can you be sure? Fine. Where's the meet and when? Japan town. After sunset. I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. Okay. Oh my god, so many things are going on. Are no ordinary clan. They're not even human! How's this guy again? Anyway, let me talk to Misty. Misty? Misty? Oh yeah? Saw a weird image out on the street. Seems like your line of work. What it look like? Grab the scan, take a look. Tarot. Major Arcanum. What you saw was a sign from a higher power. The, uh, the what now? Major Arcanum? Tarot card, archetype, knowledge held in symbolic form, a stage in your journey through life. Take your pick. Either way, you're saying some higher powers talking to me through tarot cards? Or to Silverhand. 
Or both of you, seeing as you form a harmonious whole at the moment. Hmm. Be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. Well, the world is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right, great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand from a power I know nothing about? I'd start by looking for more of them. The tarot describes so it's, a This road. is a collection so kind of mission. Okay. Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Oh, finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll I feel like it just has to deal with no. me and Come Johnny. Like, what more. we're gonna do at the end I'll of the road, at the, the end of the game. Pretty sure that's what that is. Where's Victor? Can I speak with him? Took care of Jackie's body? I... I thought you knew. Damn it. Must have been knocked out when I talked about what? it. What? What do you mean? Arasaka. They swooped in, dug their claws into What? It. What? Where'd they take him? Not sure. Had me face down to the ground, hands on my head. Tried to learn something, but... Well, you know how it is. They took Jackie's body? Fucking monos. Oh my god, what would, would it have been worse if I sent it to the mom? Because I they would have taken the mom then. This is Mega Building H8. Oh, you ran a discount yesterday. Half price on everything. Ooh, tiger claws are here. The Japanese gang. Okay, I should be careful. So you broke even. Ooh, I like her jacket. What the hell? Or sweater, whatever that is. That's cool. Alright. Oh god. Damn it, Johnny. Here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What have I missed this time? Enlightenment. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Tiger claws of Taisa Arasaka. Arasaka and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every court place dirty. That's you're not wrong, Johnny. I I can totally admit to that because we are a corp. We used to be one, so no, I I get it. No, I mean if Evelyn wanted to disappear, especially from Arasaka, she could have done better. This whole situation's bent over, cheeks spread wide. <laughs> We begin okay. Now your latest local news. Someone's in a great mood. The 54th anniversary of the Not every day a half brain dead chick drags me around a cat house on a wild war chase. So having a grand old time. Oh, you sound very sarcastic there. You think Judy's lying? Why? Little something called intuition. I think she's covering for her because Judy cares about Evelyn. You're full of shit. Got it. Anyway, thanks for talking to me, Johnny. <laughs> um, but no, I, I do believe Evelyn is hiding something for us because she didn't give us a straight answer either when we were talking with her, you know? So it doesn't surprise me that Johnny thinks so. So is this the place? All right. Oh, yeah, definitely this is it. Is this Clouds? Uh, hello? Oh! Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking My for. My eyes! Would you care to jack into the terminal? Uh, sure. Um, jacking in personal isn't safe. Looking for Evelyn. How does this work? So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Okay. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting. Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't Ma it? Ma'am, I just need a straight Once answer. You're in there, <laughs> you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. You never get what you expect. Consider my interest peaked. All right. Is it safe? 
You realize personal links aren't secure, right? Could get hit with malware straight to my core. Into paying an arm and a leg for a ripper doc. We need data from your core to pair you up with the doll. Meaning a biometric scan? Just that. If anything goes wrong, you can lodge a complaint. But that's never happened. So guaranteed, huh? Let me see if I can ask about Evelyn. Looking for an Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see hmm. her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. The algorithm Trust knows me, best, my ass. <laughs> Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. Maybe if I just hope that I'm looking for Evelyn, then it will work. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Check in, please. Damn, she's really not gonna let me... Johnny? Huh, I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? No! Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. What? What do you mean? Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. I thought he was gonna say, like, just put guns to everyone's head. I was gonna say no! We'll play our own <laughs> game. Alright, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Okay. Now for your safe word. Samurai. Samurai. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. So you should see compatible dolls in just a second. Shape of a butt? <laughs> oh. Matching. Who am I gonna get with? Sky or Angel? Two matches. Interesting. Oh. Is that normal or? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique because person. Because Bee's bisexual. <laughs> That's why. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? I kind of want Sky. The girl? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. All right. Here you go. There you go. It's all right. I got a lot of money anyway. I'm fine. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Oh. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. All right. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Oh, uh, okay. Um, how do I do that? Uh, oh, over here. God, Johnny! Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. You won't find Go any use to weapons. Shut up, Johnny! <laughs> Fucking dick. Thank you. Such an you ass! Enjoy your stay. All right, go to booth nine. This is interesting. It's very quiet in here. I figured it'd be like loud. Booth nine, this is it. Hi, I'm Sky. Hi. And you must be Valerie. J Just V. V. Just V. Only people who know. Oh, is that a real name, Valerie? Okay then. What would be v. the male one then? If you're playing male V. Um Well, looks like this'll be interesting. So, V, you're dying. Looking for someone <laughs> named Evelyn. Let's Parker. see if I can skip over this. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. Asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. 
You're afraid of something else. Okay, um... Wait a second, what am I afraid of? I think hey. you know me well. Talk to okay. me. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. I died and now I'm dying again. Happy? We're not having this conversation. I'm alone and got nobody left. Had a true friend once. Now he's gone. Soon I'll be gone too. So, won't have anyone by my side. Everything you need, you already carry inside you. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? I don't know about I in my opinion I don't think my V is okay with like what would happen like I don't think she cares about being the best anymore j just because of what happened to J Jackie you know wasn't so long ago I really wanted that but then all this shit happened seems like I was living in dreamland just want the world to know I was here that I mattered instead of a dream you're living a nightmare you're afraid of being erased as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different. I'm not gonna die completely. The void freaks me out. Well, it's mainly Johnny what he's gonna do. Death is death is death. You're gone. Game over. You can't know that for certain. Even if you've been there and back. Believe me, I've seen it. And it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since. Or for what's to come. I'm not grieving. Grief doesn't begin to describe it. Honestly, I, I can tell in her voice. By the way, the voice acting for V has been really spectacular. Especially for grieving over Jackie. It's been Silent. really good. Why? I think it really pains her. What I've her. been through. Tough to move on from that. Death was something that happened to other people. Hell that I dealt to others. Now my number will be up. Wasn't enough I died once. Have to go and do it again. Death's absurdity. The futile struggle before. These terrify you. So now what? <sighs> so what now? Now. You find out what it is you need to do. Which is? You gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have. Uh huh. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you. Oh, what's happening right now? But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Huh. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez. Don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its end. She just needed comfort of somebody. It's not even about, like, I know this place is usually about sex and whatever, but, like, V just needed the comfort of someone with her. Samurai. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Huh? Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong. Oh, no, ma'am, it's not that. Uh. No, it's not, it's not that, but thank you. 
A lot of things have been going on in my head lately. But this was different. Refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here. Come back. But I need something else. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. Need your help, please. You're good looking. It'd be a shame to lose a- Whoa! I'm not gonna like start a uh, freaking- freaking uh, talking her. What if I paid you? If you're done, he- I need this info. Name your price. Fuck you. Your Eddie's and that girl of yours. I could get fired for doing something you like You just took this. my money! We'll make it worth your while. Come on. Alright, fine. Hand it over and get out before you land me in the shit. Okay. Anything out of the ordinary happen here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's what? all I know. What? What do you mean? A number on her? Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody'd care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. A customer attacked her? I guess. I don't know. Real mess that was. Security barged in, handled it. Things went silent. You don't go around asking questions here. Better off not seeing, not hearing. Keeping your head down. Okay. Where did it happen? Her booth. Told you. She was with a client. Can I just stand there or tell me a number? Eleven. Okay. Need to get inside that booth somehow. I didn't. I didn't see the last one. Yeah? Oops. And do what? None of your biz. Can you open it or not? Sure. Just don't bother me again. Ever. Talk to Tom. Okay. Uh, sure. Who's Tom? A doll. Like the rest of us. What do you think? An XBD Damn, star? Damn, this girl's so I rude! Them? I gave you money! VIP <laughs> area. Booth 2. I think. Thanks. See? You turned out to be useful after all. Damn, this lady's so rude. Jesus Christ. Her booth is 11, right? What the hell is 11? This one. Let's take a look, shall we? I agree. I have to turn off the camera, though. Hang on. Okay. Fresh, not too much. Put it to a wound rather than a kill. this guy uh. well client wasn't the one who flew off the handle something bitter in the air yeah So something happened to her, the client didn't attack her. What do you think? Cyberpsychosis? Maybe that or something else happened. Cause she's not attacking someone else. Sounds crazy, but she could have been remotely hacked. A that runner? Weird. Okay, that's interesting. See that? See what? Nothing there. Exactly. Should be a port right there for the doll to jack into. 
They what rip is it out. Floating cigarette. Wonder why. What the fuck? It's all bad. I can't get in. What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you here now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? Is, this dog. Who's this? Don't understand that. Tiger claws. Got a right to be in there. First of all, let me turn off the camera. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. I'm gonna have to sneak in somehow, aren't I? Oh, no shortage of wise asses. I'll see. You're going back upstairs? In a minute. I need to piss first. I need a piss too. What the fuck? Okay. Sorry to this man, but I'm about to conk him out. What the hell's in here? Oh, I could have gone in here too? Maybe it's best to take like the, the back door entrance. You know? So no one sees me coming. Okay, let's get to the VIP lounge. Oh, shoot. I should put my weapon away. Am I allowed in? I have a VIP card, but am I allowed in or am I gonna get in trouble? You better keep this short and sweet. Two what brainwashed sex zombies in a anything? single day is too Whatever much. Even for uh -huh. me. Aha! Okay, Johnny. Hard day? More like hard life. So I gotta find Tom, right? Are you Tom? Hi! Hi! Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. Um, I'm, I want to talk to Evelyn. You sure you're need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. So you don't know? You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. New faceplate? Osaka or Oslo? Which was it? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, definitely Oslo. That accident involved a client, did it? Found blood in her booth. Uh, you know, shit like that happens here sometimes. And everyone's cool with that. We get new implants, recovery leave, and, well, sometimes That's even a payout. That's fucked up, though. You guys get beat up, now though. think about it. No? It is weird you went away so far. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this Woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back office. Except it's off limits to customers. Right. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Because of the pun? Okay, <laughs> Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Okay, thanks, Tom. Sorry to bother you. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Let me turn off the camera. Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. Oh my god, That's Johnny, shut up! Okay, let's see if we can. Oh, I see. Of course I'm in, in, in my capacity. Do you think they remember enough? I know it. to get in here somehow without anyone seeing me. Let me close this door right now. Oh, I can't get in there that way. I have to take the long way. Oh, man. Uh -huh. oh, here we go. Hello. Wait, no clients allowed in here. 
Can we talk? Well, dear, close the door on the way out, would ya? Or as you can see, I'm very busy. Eating? Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any. That's different. not. <sighs> you look a reasonable man. Let's make a deal. You don't understand what's at stake. Tell me where Evelyn is. Look, do you want a deal look or to me something? Like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho bitch who's never oh. been ghosted by her bill or Okay, baby. looks like we're gonna have to like, be a little aggressive with this I'm man. Uh, I can use Corpo. Uh -huh. You sit here in this dank hole you probably call your office and think you've got it made, don't you? Congrats! You read minds better than our own fucking AI. Someone get this girl a job. Ever stop to think who's behind the tiger claw puppets you call your bosses? Girl I'm looking for is linked to Arasaka. Tiger claw bosses have got their own bosses, case you didn't know. You're just too small to see them. <laughs> oh, cause you're such a big shot. Let's just say, a certain member of the Arasaka clan wouldn't be pleased if he knew something bad happened to Evelyn, and that you're the one responsible. All right, fine. I'll lay it on your straight. Ah, it's not bad using Corpo once in a while. Girl you're looking for, Parker. She ain't here. Okay, where Tell is me she? something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here. Oh, are you gonna start trouble for me? She don't know shit. Are you gonna start trouble for me? Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. Their job's to generate profit. Okay? This you talking it out straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high to recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper doc who was willing to take a look. Yeah, said he knew something or other. What does that mean? You took her to the Ripper instead of following orders. Didn't take you for someone with balls. For fuck's sake, I'm not running a slaughterhouse here. Okay. Only recycle as a last. Okay, I was about to say, what the and fuck? Family always gets a call. If there is any. Think there are any daddies out there willing to change the diapers of a brain dead little slut on the verge of cyberpsychosis? Probably not. Casting him out on the street ain't an option either. Can't risk tanking our crib. I still don't like you, I'm just saying. Well, anything's better than a bullet to the brain. <laughs> you know, that's what every doll says. I'm starting to like you. You looking for work? No, I'm not chance? working for you. Oh my god. The Ripper. Name and address. Don't know her last name. Don't fuck with me. Bro, I'll whip out my katana. I'm not. Goes by fingers. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Wanna find Evelyn? Look there. And don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. Quicker you're out of here, the better. Alright. Johnny, any words? Doc Fingers on Jig Jig Street. Sounds like a co ed's wet dream. Alright. Well, th that means Evelyn's still alive then, right? Oh! Got a real charm this What the hell? Place. In that slimy, subterranean kind of way. That's See, her opinion about dollhouses hasn't changed. Oh, but it has. Before, I wouldn't have touched one with a ten-mile pole. Now I'm thinking a fire'd really make this place shine. What? <laughs> Think Fingers has got her. 
Think we'll find her there? V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. You don't need to be an ass to me, Johnny! <laughs> this fucking guy! Oh my god! Oh! Oh, I'm coughing blood! You had a plan. You tried. It fell flat. Now you're flat. Don't look in any condition to find Hellman. What the hell's happening to me now? Call Judy. I can't call anyone. I think I'm gonna pass out. Ugh, fuck! The hell's that? No, 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 no damn, damn it. it. Jesus, the fuck what do you, do you want, want from me? me? Johnny, what's going on? What? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Are you sure? Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. You just want my body. You don't want me to live. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half century old score and need settling. Oh god, there's just ass in my face. It. That's what I need you for. For some ideal to square a grudge? But why? Fighting for some dated ideal? They're still in a personal vendetta? You don't need to know. Here to get me from point I do to need point to know. You're using my body, Johnny. Listen, I know things. Where we can save your life. Who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Makoshi's what exactly? I don't know if I trust him, that's my problem yet, because he just flip-flopped all of a sudden. Okay, so this Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Okay. Yeah, seen the memories. Did a real number on you. Okay, seems we got a few more things to broach than I thought, but that'll come later. Anyway, when Soul Killer fries, roasts, and boils you, you die. But the contents of your mind get copied to an engram first. Mm -hmm. Sure. <clears throat> That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Makoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage. Oh, God, Johnny, please stop. 50 years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. How do you plan to destroy Arasaka? And, uh, how do you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bomb's named Alta Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is. Not yet, but you will once we find what we need. Okay? For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. There he goes. Okay, uh, before we continue with that, let me call Judy. B. You called. <laughs> what? Uh, I promised I would. Promised I'd call, didn't I? Promising's one thing, keeping it's a whole other bag. So, managed to learn anything? Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. 
carted her off to a ripper dock goes by fingers. I'm oh, not... shit. Do you know? Know where to find this fingers character? Yeah, runs a dinky chop shop off Jig Jig Street. Fuck me. Guys, all kinds of bad news. Heading there now, to find her. I told her to stay the fuck away from clouds. Uh, all right, later, V. Okay, bye, Judy. Oh my god, there's so many things we have to do. Okay, guys, I think this is a good place to stop this episode. I want to deal with Evelyn's, like, storyline first, and then we'll move on to the next part, which is meeting up with Takimura, and then deal with, uh, freaking Johnny, whatever he wants, because I- I know his is more, like, endgame stuff, but I don't know, do you guys think we can trust Johnny? Do you really think that he wants to help us separate himself from V? And then that way he can live his own life and V can have her life back? Because I- I really- I think he's just saying this because he knows it's the only way that V will cooperate with him. I don't know if I can really trust Johnny, he seems kind of shady, you know? And I feel like the only way we would have him on our side is if we kind of appease with him by going against the Arasaka, which I have no problems with, but it's just like I don't think he's really there to help us. That's the thing that I have. But I feel like I can trust Takimura, I just think he's a little bit gullible because whoever his contact is, I do think we shouldn't rely on them too much just because, you know, the whole thing with um, everything else and now that he's kicked out of Arasaka and he's kind of on his own, he should be more careful. But I do like him and I feel like we can trust him. Anyway, this is a lot to take in. Hopefully in the next part we can deal with all of that. And if you guys enjoyed this video, remember to leave a like. Let me know in the comments what you think and be sure to subscribe and hit the bell button for more episodes of Cyberpunk 2077. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!